all systems go, kid. Let's fly. In 1977, two spacecraft were launched to study the outer planets. For five points, kid, what were they named? Voyager. Voyager, that's absolutely right, for five points. Both of these probes were sent to study the two largest planets in our solar system. For six points, name these two planets. Jupiter and Saturn, you got them both right, kid. Six points. Now, in January 1986, Voyager 2 flew past the next planet. For three points, kid, what is its name? Uranus. Uranus, right, three more points. Okay, kid, last question for another three points. In 1989, Voyager 2 will fly past yet another planet, another gas giant beyond Uranus. What is its name? Neptune. Right again, kid, Neptune. And that's 17 points. Great score, kid. All strapped in, kid? Okay then, blast off. Today we're gonna talk about a very special satellite in our solar system. This is a picture of that very special satellite. It's the only satellite in our solar system with an atmosphere. Here's the first question, kid, for 10 points. What is the name of this satellite? Now this is a hard question, kid, so I'm gonna make it multiple choice. Is the name of this satellite Ganymede, the moon, or is it called Titan? That's right, kid. Titan is the name of the only satellite in our solar system with an atmosphere. That's 10 points. Now here's a companion question for another 10 points. What planet does Titan orbit? Does it orbit around Mars? Does it orbit around Saturn? Or does Titan orbit the planet Jupiter? Saturn. Saturn, that's right, kid. Titan, the only satellite with an atmosphere, orbits around the planet Saturn. That's 20 points for the day, kid. Nice score. Hey, you're really getting to know your way around our solar system. Howdy, kid. Ready to go? Okay, blast off. Today, we're going to talk about satellites. You know, kid, people get real confused when they talk about satellites, and that's because the word satellite has many definitions. Let's take a look at a few objects here, and you tell me which ones are satellites, okay? What about this object, kid? Is this a satellite? That's right, kid. This is an Intelsat communication satellite. This is used to broadcast communication signals all over the Earth. And because it revolves around the Earth, it's a satellite. That's five points, kid. Now, how about these two tiny objects in orbit around the planet Mars? They aren't spacecraft. Are they satellites? That's right, kid, another five points. Their names are Deimos and Phobos. They're the two natural satellites of Mars, and they're only about five and 10 miles across. Okay, kid, one more. How about this object? Is it also a satellite? Yes. Right again, kid. The moon is our planet's only natural satellite. That's a total of 15 points for the day. 